In this tutorial we will show how to model a simple expansion chamber two ways. One way is using three pipes. The second way is using two pipes and the SIDLAB expansion chamber element. The example we use is in the SIDLAB health menu under tutorials and it is called Los simple expansion chamber. These are the this is the model and the dimensions we will be using. Notice it is just a small pipe on one end, a small pipe on the opposite end connected by a larger pipe. So we will get to SIDLAB and we first go to the modeling screen of SIDLAB and we will drag in the first pipe. There we give it a dimen length dimension of hundred and um, or four hundred millimeters and we will give it a diameter of hundred and sixteen point five millimeters. Uh, notice that SIDLAB fills in the area. With it, since we have the same pipe on the other end of the large pipe we will simply do a control C copy and then a control V paste and we now have two pipes, two identical pipes for the beginning and the end of the, the muffler. Uh, you'll see that in both cases they have the identical uh, length area and diameter. Uh, we now bring in the middle pipe which is a larger diameter so it will have a diameter of uh, 240 millimeters and it will have a uh, a length of 500 and uh, 40 millimeters. Now we must connect the model using the connection icon. And we need to give the model a beginning point, which is a green dot, and a stopping point, which is a red dot. So we now can go to the solution screen, and we are ready to calculate uh, the transmission loss for this model uh, and we're going to increase the frequency range to 2000 which will be obvious why we did that later. Uh, we press the calculate acoustics button and we get transmission loss uh, as a function of frequency and you see there our lobe type behavior which is typical of a very simple expansion chamber muffler. Uh, the red dotted line shows the limitation of the model, so the model is good at frequencies below the red line and uh, not so good frequencies above the red line. And this is because in this case the, the, the way we did the model is uh, assuming uh, plane wave theory uh, through the whole system. Now we want to be able to compare this to the model that we're going to do with the expansion chamber element. So we will go back to the management screen and now we will save that current version. And we can give it a a new name or a new description and we'll simply call that three pipes. Now if we go back to the modeling screen uh, notice over here in the SIDLAB elements there is a element for expansion chamber. Uh, so we're going to eliminate the middle pipe and we will drag in and drop the expansion chamber element. Now there's a lot more information that we can put in uh, to this element but for now we will just again repeat the chamber length of 540 millimeters and the chamber diameter of 240 millimeters and then it also is going to want to uh, inlet and outlet pipe di diameter which is the same as these two pipes so we will give it 116.5 and the other pipe well the and the outlet diameter of the same 116.5 Now we have all the necessary information, uh, the sufficient information in, uh, in order to solve this model. So we will connect 
as before. And now we are ready to run this model in the solution screen. We will calculate acoustics. And we now have a new transmission loss. Uh, notice that the lobes are, are no longer the same height. This is because the, the SID Lab uh, expansion chamber element is including high order modes in its calculation. And notice also that the red line has moved up from here up to almost 1700 hertz. And so the model is good over a much wider range because SID Lab is now calculating plane wave and higher order modes in the expansion chamber element. If we want to compare that directly with uh, the first model, uh, we can press the compare button and then we go back to the first version which we made which is called three pipes and we do a plot comparison and it will compare the two plots. Uh, so this ends the tutorial on the simple expansion chamber uh, model.